Welcome to Ravens Report. Thanks for watching. I'm Myra. And I'm Derek. It's Friday, January 13th, National Korean American Day, and National Rubber Ducky Day, National Sticker Day, and National Blame Somebody Else Day. Let's start on the mat. Yesterday, wrestling had three duels facing Summit, Aloha, and Marshfield. The Ravens won in dominant fashion, beating Summit 81-0, to Marshfield 66-18, to and Aloha 45-36. to Awesome work. Today, the team competes in the Oregon Classic along with 80 other top Oregon wrestling teams. Today's duels include Silverton, Milwaukee, and Mountain View starting at 2.30, 3.30, and 4.30. Ridgeview needs to win two out of three to advance to the championship bracket tomorrow. Go Ravens! Boys basketball was at Bend High last night and played an outstanding defensive game. They also executed the offense to get great shots. Unfortunately, there was a lid on the basket that Ravens couldn't quite crack. The Ravens' tenacity on defense held the Lava Bears to 35 points, which is 15 points under their season average. Every once in a while, everything can go right except the shots don't fall. Keep at it, Ravens. And the girls play tonight right here at Ridgeview. Come support the t at <laughs> them at 5.30 and 7. Go Ravens! Swim matched up with Ben in a friendly competition last night at Cascade Swim Center. For those of you who don't know swim, duels are often a more fun affair than the more competitive multi-team matchups. So there wasn't really winners and losers, but a ton of fun as the team prepares for their annual meet this weekend and next Tuesday. Do you play tennis? Are you thinking about playing tennis? Well, listen up. There is a meeting for all boys and girls tennis players or those interested in trying it out. On Wednesday at lunch in the Skybox, Mr. Holloway and Coach Barry will be there. See you then. The NFL playoffs start tomorrow. Who's going to win? Jordan has some predictions about this wild card weekend. Let's head over. NFL playoffs are upon us. This is where the top seven teams from each conference take on each other for the ultimate goal and the ultimate championship, the Super Bowl. This is a time of season where fans might experience happiness, sadness, shock, excitement, or even like crying. Today I'm going to be trying to predict the wild card round. Are you ready? Let's go. Starting this Saturday, we have the Seahawks 49ers. Honestly, I think the 49ers are just going to stop them and stifle the Seahawks with their defense like they have all year. I think it's going to be no different, so I'm going to go with the 49ers. Up next, Chargers, Jaguars. This one is a hard one to choose from because both are really good teams and the Jaguars are peaking at the right moment. But I'm going to have to go with the Chargers simply because Justin Herbert is like that guy already. Above, He's above Trevor Lawrence. So like, I'm going to go with Chargers beating the Jaguars. Then on Sunday, we got Dolphins, Bills. Honestly, unless the Dolphins don't get Tua back, I'm going to have to go Buffalo because I don't think the Dolphins can like do what they did against the Jets in the last week of the NFL and just win. I think they need Tua to help them win this game or else I think they're out, so I'm going to go with the Bills. Then, on another game on Sunday, Giants-Vikings. Honestly, I think the Giants are going to win this despite being the lowest seed. They only lost to the Vikings this regular season due to... 61 yard field goal, which, yes, it's heartbreaking to lose, and it's still a lot, but I think they could be in there, contend with the Vikings, and still be. The last game on Sunday, Ravens and Bengals. Like the Dolphins Bills game, I think it's going to determine whether Baltimore has Lamar Jackson or not. If they don't have Lamar Jackson, I think they're going to lose this game because I don't think Tyler Huntley can do it. The final game on Monday night to wrap up Super Wild Card Weekend the, the Cowboys and the Buccaneers. Honestly, as a Buccaneers fan, I want to say that we were going to win this, but I just don't know it. This is a hard one. I'm going to go with the Buccaneers. You never count out Tom Brady. He's the GOAT. So honestly, I'm going to go with the Bucs winning that game. What do you think of my predictions? Do you agree with them? Do you disagree with them? 
And that's our show for today. As always, check out our YouTube page at youtube.com forward slash Reggie Ravens. I'm Derek. And I'm Myra. Have an epic day. Stay safe and stay classy. Woo!